Hello there, everybody, and welcome back to more Let's Play Her Story for the PC. I'm Dave McCauley. Let's continue on with looking at Doug as a search term. Yes, Doug. That is not... <laughs> wow! <laughs> yeah, just look, look at my... Look at all that shit. Look at where I save all my, uh, my footage. I parked up in the street. It was busy, so I had to park down the end of the road. Walked up, knocked on the door, no answer. I took my keys out of my bag and unlocked the door. The main lock was unlocked. You can tell because the key doesn't turn when you try to turn it to the left. I walked in. Simon's coat wasn't on the peg. I couldn't see his shoes in the shoe rack. I shouted out. Um, I walked straight into the kitchen because he usually sits in there to have a cup of tea and read his paper, but he wasn't there. I touched the kettle, it was cold. I looked quickly in the living room, nothing. So I walked upstairs to the bedroom and he wasn't there. I didn't search for him because it was pretty clear he wasn't there. I had a shower, the phone rang whilst I was in the shower, I didn't answer it, I think it was Eric. Then I was just exhausted. So I lay down on the bed and I fell asleep, though I didn't mean to. I woke up a couple of hours later and I was surprised to see no one in the bed next to me. And then I remembered where I was and what had happened. That's when Eric called again, this time I spoke to him. Then I called Doug and Elena. And then I decided to come and see you. That enough? Cheer. Probably not enough, but what the hell. Am I right? Yeah. What? There's so many... So much more shit. 1984. 1984. We were living at Doug and Eleanor's. I lost the baby at the end of spring and my parents died in the summer. It was a hot summer. A heat wave. Ten years ago, 1984. So when they discovered the bodies, it was just awful. Because of the circumstances, them dying together like that, they brought in a lot of police. A forensic entomologist. I had to look that up. It was because of the heat. It's just awful. There's nothing on her spoon. I'm very disturbed about the lack of drippage on her spoon. All right, this being an investigation, why are there no fingerprints? So finger print. Or fingerprints? Sure. Fingerprints. Oh, holy hell. Okay. Fine. I've never had my fingerprints taken before. I once put my hand on the oven. That's not gonna matter. Fingerprints. Why is she so baffled by this? Yes, yeah. I would have cleaned them. I changed the sheets too. Where the fingerprints in all those places. I also changed my underwear. Could they have been my parents' fingerprints? I'm not sure how long they last for, but is that possible? What? Detective uh, Sergeant. Yeah, achievement. Hell yeah. Really? Really? Go on then. Take the cup. Done. Run your fingerprints. I will. They'll match. Okay. Fucking idiot. Fuck Don't you call me a fucking idiot. Stupid bitch. Alright. I'll do what I want. Man, um... That's everything I have on this piece of paper. What about common names? Like Dave. Ben. Uh, Chad. I don't know. Uh, Angel? Um. Uh, Terry? I don't know. Uh, Sarah. Sarah? Sarah is one of the ones. Okay. What the fuck? I would have been a good mother. 
I was young, but I would have been a good mother. She was a girl, by the way, the baby. We were going to call her Sarah. Simon wanted to call her Ava after his nana. Ava? But I didn't want her to have a symmetrical name. Let's try uh, Ava. Ava? Oh, same thing. Uh, chit chat, sure, let's chit chat. How do I. Oh, call. Hey, you done? Archive PC. Good, so you think you understand why your mother did what she. What? What? You think you understand why your mother did what she did? That's understandable, Sarah. What the fuck? You can always come back again. I'll be outside. Log out and meet me on the road. Uh, what? Log out and meet me over the road? What? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Stop that. No. I can't log out. I don't want to log out. User is offline. If the game quits on me, I don't... Um... I hope you guys understand. Here we go. We're going to log out. Okay. That's it? I'm so lost. I understand that we were Sarah. Holy shit. My mind. My mind is so lost. I don't know, man. Apparently I'm supposed to be in the credits here. Because I pre-ordered this game. I don't know. We'll see what happens. There I am! Haha, <laughs> yes! There I am! Awesome! Yeah! So cool! <laughs> oh, I just got a huge pop uh, for myself. Oh, so cool. This game was great. I, 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 I have to... SB, Sarah, if you're, if you're stuck, you can always try admin random? Is that what it said? 
Yo, what the hell? So admin... Admin... Random... I think that's what it said. Continue. Let's try this out. So, admin... Random. No, oh, what well, spelling actually counts. Admin... Lucky dip. Lucky dip achievement? What the hell? Okay. I've given blood before. Do you need to take that few records? Uh. What's this? A mobile phone? Yeah. Well, they have one for the glaciers, but it's only for work. I can't remember the number. It's in the kitchen. I saw it plugged into its charging cradle. Kitchen? Kitchen? Bruce. Oh, yeah, no, it's nothing. I was going through the top cupboard of my kitchen and the chair slipped and I kind of hit the door with my face. <laughs> I mean, how like hell? <laughs> oh, I'm sure that happened. You got knocked the fuck out, I'm sure. What? It's not funny. Okay. Um... Stop! Fake drinking! Street. It was busy, so I parked down at the end of the road. I walked up to the house, I knocked on the door, no answer. I took my keys out of my bag, unlocked the door. The main lock was unlocked. I could tell because the key wouldn't turn when I tried to turn it to the left. I walked in, Simon's coat wasn't on the peg, I couldn't see his shoes on the shoe rack. Um, I shouted out for him. I walked straight into the kitchen, he usually sits in there to have a cup of tea and read his paper. He wasn't there. I touched the kettle, it was cold. Um, I looked quickly into the living room, nothing. I walked upstairs to the bedroom, he wasn't there. I didn't search for him because it was pretty clear he wasn't there. And then I had a shower. Whilst I was in the shower, the phone rang. I think it was Eric, his boss. I didn't answer it. Then I came out and I was just exhausted. So I lay down on the bed and I fell asleep, but I didn't mean to. I woke up a couple of hours later and I was surprised to see no one in the bed next to me. And then I remembered where I was and what had happened. That's when Eric called again. I spoke to him. Then I called Simon's parents. And then I decided to come and see you. Is that enough? No, no, that's not enough. I don't care. I mean, I care. What am I talking about? Uh, admin random. Oh. He has a wallet. A huge, silly thing. Leather. Real leather, I think. He packs it full of stuff. Business cards, receipts, lottery tickets. He always carries it in his back pocket. I think that's why he's got a bad back. Sets the discs. I haven't seen it, so he must have it on him. He always takes it out of his back pocket before when he comes in, if he's in the house. Yeah. Uh. No, no, no. I need to save this. Uh. What is it? Uh. Admin. Uh. Ran. Dumb. Admin random. Yeah! A long time. Long time what? We got married when I was 17. Whoa. 16 going on 17. Stuff and things. Childhood sweetheart. Something like that. Right. Only married detective. 
Oh, why are you hitting on me? You want a piece of this? I think she might want a piece of it. Not gonna lie. She wants a piece of the D. The big D. The big Dave. That's what I'm talking about. Rand, um... So I'm not gonna lie. I also heard about this other one where I go admin unlock. And more than a guest achievement. Account unlocked. Query maximum now set to 15. Wow. Okay. So we can add more clips instead of just five we can go to 15 huh I don't know where to go from here I guess we'll be back when we find more about what's going on okay Another thing was admin share. Uh, and uh, it's trying to mail a link. It's, it's literally, you can't see it right now. It's trying to access my mail. Wow. Wow. It's... <laughs> It tried to access my mailing account to send an email. What the fuck, dude? Yo! <laughs> oh, we'll be back with more. Alright, one more thing I need to check out before ending this is the Morse code. The Morse code that she was tapping. So, Hannah... Eve. Eve. Let's see. Mum and Dad had never had any reason to notice. They were always busy. If Hannah was eating a lot, they didn't mind. And she didn't put on any weight. But girl has a healthy appetite. Now, if they heard us talking in the attic, they just thought it was Hannah playing one of her games. And that Eve was our imaginary friend. Once, she was already up and dressed and ready to go to school and I snuck down for a piss. Mum saw me in my underwear she went mad. Get dressed this instant! So I ducked into our bedroom <laughs> and seconds later out came Hannah, dressed and ready. Mum was amazed. Oh, I bet she was. Holy crap, like... That's weird. And then tap code. Tap code was another one. That, the Morse code. I don't know what it means. I want to talk to the developer. Um, I, I have him on Twitter. So I'll be sure to be talking to him throughout the next couple of days to figure out what's going on. And hopefully wa he watches this Let's Play. We'll see what happens. I mean... This game is interesting as all hell. It's amazing. I'm so satisfied with my purchase. With that said though, guys, depending on how you felt about this episode and this Let's Play, like or dislike, if you felt it was one of your favorite videos, hit that favorite button. And if you haven't already done so and you enjoy the content that I bring to you, be sure to subscribe. I'm Dan McCauley. Fuse4Gaming. I'll see you guys next time. Huzzah!